mum was always in the kitchen cooking. You know, we always sat down as a family for dinners, always, and Sunday lunches were a big thing in our home. Um, yeah, so I guess my mum was pretty influential in that, for sure. But my best friend Camilla, her mum was a chef, and I used to spend a lot of time at her house, and um, that was pretty cool. We would often have midnight raids at her fridge <laughs> see what tastiness we could find. <laughs> So she was, Karen Goodwin Roberts was a, a woman that definitely played a big role in me taking cooking seriously and more professionally. Yeah. So she inspired me in that direction. Yeah. yeah. I started working at a restaurant called Franklin's um, Restaurant and David Miles, the head chef there, but there is a woman, Jess, who um, is a chef and she used to work for Christine Mansfield. Um, and to be honest, I'm really inspired by her because she put so much effort into everything she does and soul into it and attention to details and the flavour combinations and then David's way he presents things and uses um, left of centre ingredients. I think that's been extremely inspiring for me to be around and um, influenced by because um, I really enjoy um, the rawness of cooking, of just having in getting ingredients and having to make something with it not necessarily having a recipe but actually being inspired by your produce so I get that from David he's inspired by his produce to create from that place um, so I really vibe with that um, I worked at La Bruna restaurant in Newtown uh, cooking there which was an incredible experience with Scott Minervini so he's a uh, Italian French chef by Jeff, who used to live in Melbourne. Him and his partner now have a restaurant, and it's just he just does it for the love of food. So I think that's where I definitely was influenced with just um, creating, not necessarily for the big dollars or the big people, but because you enjoy feeding people. One of my other passions is recipe writing, so I've just started my own web page, and I wanted to share it with you guys. So. Please log on to my webpage and we've now got a YouTube clip also channel. So there's lots of amazing recipes, beautiful footage. So please subscribe and um, be part of my journey. Hey, I'm Sarah Glover and I'm a chef. Um, I've started a blog called Foodie Gang and the idea around that is to bring to you cool stories, things that inspire me, and recipes that you can use every day in your kitchen. My passions are surfing. I love the ocean. If I'm in a bad mood, you should just throw me in the ocean and I'll come out. <laughs> a better person. <laughs> it's true though. Um, I grew up in Tasmania and I spent all my life there till I was 21. And from there, I actually moved to Queensland. I wanted to be a dietitian for a while, but that went for lasted about a year. Got over it. Moved to Sydney to the Big Smoke in my little V Dub Beetle. Packed it up, moved down. I worked for Quicksilver because I loved surfing, and that was a real passion of mine and being creative for about two years. And then I fell back into my passion, which is cooking. I've been cooking since I was 16 years um, professionally where well, I left school when I was at year 10 and I did my Cert 3 in commercial cookery and um, it's only been until now that I've really decided that this is something I want to pursue and share with you. So I hope you enjoy uh, my stories and what I've got to offer and my creativity and, and hope it inspires you to follow your dreams and your passions also.